I'm going to take $500 and turn it into $100,000 trading the Forex markets. I'm going to explain the entire process to you right here, right now. Now, I know what you might be thinking. That's nuts. It's not possible. But I'm going to explain to you how over the course of six months, it is kind of realistic, even though, yes, I'm going to have to be quite aggressive. Now, I will start this video by telling you that what I'm attempting to do is quite aggressive and is not necessarily something that a beginner needs to do, especially somebody that depends on this money for other things. And like I always say, when you are looking to get involved with prop firms or get involved with trading, make sure you are only putting money at risk that you can afford to lose firstly, and money that is not going to affect your monthly lifestyle to not be able to pay rent at the end of the month if you lose this money. So make sure that you adhere to this because the pressure that will be put on you if you are risking money that is this important to you will cause you to lose the money guaranteed. Now that we've established that this money, I'm going to be quite aggressive with it to get these results in the desired time frame. I need to explain to you the plan of how I intend to achieve this within like six months. We basically got to start with the $500. Now this $500 of course is going to go towards a $100,000 prop firm account. And my plan with this is to purchase prop firm accounts from different companies. Firstly, because prop firm accounts are quite hard to manipulate in terms of the results because I'm working with different companies and why would these companies manipulate their results, especially multiple different ones, right? I'm not just working with the company that I recommend, which is Blue Guardian, just because they are really good guys and they have really good conditions and really nobody has complaints about it and I've gotten a ton of payouts from them. So if you want 10% off, the link to that is in the description below. Just use the code GARTRADE and you get 10% off at Blue Guardian with your next challenge account. But I'm going to use other firms as well just to verify that yes, I am using different firms and it's not just me manipulating the result. Secondly, having diversification is good anyways, okay? So I'm gonna be using different accounts and showing you how I manage all of those accounts. But I'm going to get this first $100,000 evaluation. It's gonna take me between one to two months to pass it. So that's already two months gone of my time. Now after this, I'm going to be able to earn on this account. Now, when I am trading an evaluation account versus a funded account, it's completely different. The risk management on an evaluation is going to be a little bit more aggressive i'm going to be risking like two percent per trade whereas on a funded account i'm going to be a lot less aggressive risking about half a percent to one percent per trade now once i've got the funded account what happens next i try to make a little bit of profit so that i can purchase more prop firm accounts and get more funding by the end of the six months i intend to have over seven figures in funding as well as obviously make the one hundred thousand dollar target for profit and to do this i'm going to need to scale extremely quickly so my plan is in the second or third month depending on how quickly i pass the first 100k evaluation i'm going to need to make between three to five percent on that and then withdraw it what i'm going to do is as soon as i get to three percent withdraw it and and then hopefully I can make another 2% there in the next you know, week or two weeks to come and withdraw that as well and put that straight back into accounts. Now with this three to $5,000, I'm gonna purchase more accounts. Now for $1,000, you can roughly get $200,000 in capital. So the minimum I will be able to get is about 600K if I work the maths out correctly. So let's say I only make 3% and I get $3,000, I will get 600K and 600K that I'm busy trying to pass. Now let's say trying to pass those takes me another two months. I will be then at month four, all right? And so for the next two months, I'm gonna be trying to earn between three and 5% once again on that 100K. And all of the capital from that is going back in to funded accounts. Once I have my one funded account and I can be very, very conservative on that and risk maximum of 1%, I can then start to bank on that making me profits every month almost. I mean, some months maybe we won't make any profit, who knows? What I'm trying to say is, if I fail any of these accounts coming up, I can then use the income from that one less aggressive account to pay for more evaluations. So these new evaluations after month two, I'm going to be a lot more aggressive because I have this 
non-aggressive account that is essentially earning me money to buy more accounts. I hope this makes sense to you guys. So after I've got this account, I'm going to be significantly more aggressive on these accounts coming up, risking between two and three percent trying to pass within a month. That is my goal. The way I see it is that within one to two months, I should pass a batch of 600 Ks. Now, even if I fail the first 600 K, yes, it's three thousand dollars down the drain, but I'm hoping that by the next by the following month i am then able to generate another three thousand dollars and then get another 600k but essentially in order to reach my goals i'm going to need to have at least seven figures so essentially by month four i'm going to be looking to have about seven hundred thousand dollars worth of funding and in month five hopefully we're going to be at the 1.2 to 1.4 million dollar mark in funding well as you can see after another two months after that we're going to be quite easily getting to that one hundred thousand dollar goal all we're needing to do is make between four and five percent on these accounts per month um, and we can quite comfortably get there remember a million dollars five percent on that is fifty thousand dollars and we're going to have about 1.2 to 1.4 million at the end of this if my mathematics is correct now i'm really hoping to make it in the six month period but if i still need to take seven or eight months that's also okay i'm not putting too much pressure on myself but i do have the goal of six months so i know all of this sounds kind of crazy but i hope that kind of makes sense as to how i'm planning to achieve these goals and perhaps i even push it for another two to three months after that maybe i can get to a million that would be great turn 500 dollars into a million if you'd like to see that let me know in the comments down below what your thoughts would be the real reason i wanted to create this video is to inspire you guys and to show you what is possible when you have all of the ingredients in place when you have number one a good psychology which mine is okay and <laughs> when you've got a good strategy and an edge on the market that you've back tested which also plays into your psychology and number three you have got a good risk management and you have that as part of your trade plan when you've got these ingredients you can achieve insanely great things and i'm going to show you guys without a shadow of a doubt that is possible because i know that on my journey when i was looking to achieve these kinds of things i needed to see other people do it first because it makes you believe in your deep subconscious mind that this is possible and you can achieve it and it just takes one person to show you that it's possible and i hope i can be that person for you guys and for a lot of you people that say that this whole thing is a scam and nobody makes money with prop firms nobody can make money in the forex market i want to prove every single one of you wrong not to say that i was right but to prove to you that you can achieve great things if you put these ingredients into place but also you guys need to stop being so damn cynical and believe in yourself and believe that great things happen because it's very important to be positive but at the same time not be an idiot now i'm also going to be recording every single one of the trades that i take in a telegram group that's completely free to join the link is in the description join it and you can follow every single trade that i take i'm going to post before and after and i'm going to let you know exactly how that plays out and i'm going to update you on my journey so you can consistently see the results of what i'm achieving on top of this, I'm also going to be creating a track record with Darwin X Zero, which essentially is going to be my long term track record to attract investors. You can do this as well. Um, there's also a link in the description where you can start a Darwin X Zero account, create a track record and attract investors of your own and eventually start a hedge fund one day. Who knows? They allow you to do that once you have a big enough track record and enough invest. All right, everyone. So thank you very much for watching. If you enjoyed this, please do subscribe down below and let me know in the comments what you thought about this. If you think I'm a nutbag for trying to achieve something like this, if you think it's possible and if you think I'm going to achieve it, let me know in the comments down below. If you think I'm an idiot, also let me down in the comments below. Cheers, everybody. I will update you very soon. Make sure you join the Telegram group to follow along. My old bitch front like Jackie Brown.